Hello there, this is Lawrence uh, KL7L up in uh, 50 miles north of Anchorage, Alaska. And this is the construction of the, the second VLF loop for experimentation work. Uh, we're waiting for our license for around about 24 kilohertz. And this is an expanded, uh, larger uh, number of turn loop. It's a 10 foot uh, Octo loop based on the design by VE7SL, and this one's got about 25 turns of uh, 20 gauge wire in the loop. And uh, you're looking at the matching box there, and from that, we can add uh, switch in uh, additional amounts of capacitance. At the moment, it switches in an additional thousand uh, picofarad across the, uh, the red wire you can see there, which is the uh, coupling loop that goes around about six inches inside the uh, the perimeter of the main tuning loop and the main tuning loop is uh, tuned by uh, uh, this capacitor here that's uh, basically zero well 20 puff up to about a thousand and we can also uh, that's for resonating at the frequency we want and then we can also switch in uh, taps uh, it's lovely little gunky stuff down here, but we've got taps at uh, the main inductance of the loop is about uh, 4.78 millihenries, and there's a tap here at uh, 1.35, and the top tap is at 0.82, and that allows us to use it over a frequency spectrum right up into the broadcast band. So it's uh, made out of pretty heavy duty materials uh, to suffer the, uh, the rigors of. Alaska life and uh, it will be supported off uh, a fiberglass pole here which will be into the ground using a, uh, a 4x4 post and stood off that 